it's Tuesday morning and it's currently 9 24 a.m. and I have to finish two loads of laundry pack complete some work and get my apartment ready for me to be away from it all before noon so it's like two and a half hours I'm flying home to Florida to stay with my family for two weeks just to get some family time in while I have the flexibility of working remote and yeah it'll be a good time I'll take you along and if you're new here my name is Marcella and I'm a software engineer based in Los Angeles California but I'll be working from Florida for the rest of this week I gotta get packing and I'll catch you guys later but welcome to this walk So, T minus one hour until I have to leave. I have some of the clothes that I'm going to bring, some of the stuff I'm going to bring laid out on my bed. I always lay out my stuff before I pack because I need to see visually what I'm bringing, like how many pairs of pants, how many shirts, how many workout clothes, how many, like everything I'm bringing. So I lay everything out. I'm still waiting on one load of laundry. I put it in at around 10.30 right before my meeting. It'll be done soon. And once that's done, I'm going to finish laying everything out, throw everything in my luggage, and should be good to go. So I have to... Actually, why don't I, as we speak, as I'm talking to you, I'll just download the episodes that I need to download. I'm just downloading episode 35 and episode 36 because these are the ones I haven't watched yet. I forget to mention, I just did my morning check-in with my team and I got out the PR that I wanted to get out before I leave, um, fix something in the PR as well, like the NPM audit check that checks if packages are um, a security issue, so fix the vulnerability there. And then I let them know I'm going to be out for the rest of the day. We're about 45 minutes away from needing to head out and this is where I'm at. So I've laid everything out. Here I've got a bunch of dresses, like four or five of those because I plan to live in those most of the time. Here are my bottoms. I only brought a few. Here I've got legging and workout clothes and just shorts. This pile is full of my cute tops. Tops I would wear to like dinner or if I'm going out to brunch or something. They're all t-shirts. This is my swimsuit corner. Just brought like four different swimsuits. The oversized button up that I throw over my swimsuits and that's a proper beach cover up. I've got a bucket hat as well as just a regular baseball cap. And this is like undergarments. I use these packing cubes and they're awesome. They're on Amazon. I got them like four or five years ago. And then I throw in a dryer sheet in each of the packing cubes just to keep everything smelling nice. We're gonna transform this and we're gonna put it into that bag. <laughs> Boulevard sandwiches to go. Sometimes it's all alright, but when the devil visits, and me and Jesus Alrighty, I'm about to head out. I changed, I just I'm wearing this tank top because it gets cold on the plane. On top of it, I'm gonna throw this um crew neck. So that's my trick for when I go to hot places, wear a nice top, but then I bring a hoodie to throw over on the plane. I'm gonna go pick up the sandwiches and then I'll Uber to the airport from there. So exciting stuff.
was three hours behind, so it's like 9 a.m. over there. I really hate coming to the East Coast because I hate waking up late. But when I wake up at like 8 a.m. LA time, it's already like 11 here. I hate that, but um, I'm obviously gonna be here for two weeks. So as I get more assimilated, early morning, I need to drink my coffee. Of course, it's making sense. I see you pulling up to meet me in your car I know you didn't have to drive, you don't live far from me I know we're friends, but baby, something's on my mind So I apologize for taking all this time, but I got it's now 1 30 we have our team stand up so i'm gonna do that right now put on a, my sister's hoodie because it's cold in here just finished the morning check-in with my team. Like an interesting day because I had some work that I needed to do, but my project manager um, is prioritizing a different ticket that I need to finish. And that ticket is a spike ticket. All that means is he has an idea for a project and a spike ticket is just there um, to kind of uh, figure out all the different components technically that it would take to implement that project, figure out how long it would take, and then next sprint we will tackle on that project. Sorry if there's noise in the background. Yeah, so that's kind of what I'm working on today, reaching out to a bunch of people, asking different questions about different systems that we need to plug into, and um, figure out how to implement the system. And these are kind of like some of my favorite tickets because you get to think about how to implement something, so it's pretty fun. Um, anyway, gonna make lunch now and then continue working later. TTYL. So we make our own bread. We use this bread maker to actually just make the dough, which is kind of funny. Sometimes we cook it in here, but why don't we cook it in here now? It doesn't taste as good as when you cook it in the oven. Yeah, so we cook it in the oven. So this nice bread is so sweet. good though. So now they're gonna rise and they're gonna be like bigger than the pan. Yeah, we get fat fat. We let it rise in there. Trying to tell you baby, but you just don't seem to see it so I No, get up, pretend I don't love you like Hi, so you haven't missed much. It's now pretty dark out because it looks like it's gonna storm, but it's 6.44. I think I'm gonna stop working for the day. Um, kind of got everything I needed to do done. Today I made tickets for that exploratory ticket that I was talking about. I talked to everyone, figured out how to implement it, and then I made tickets for the next sprint. But yeah, that was that was kind of the biggest portion of my day. Also, let me show you how stormy it looks out. It was looking fine all day, but... Hello, Stormy.
What's there to say? There's nothing but space in between you and I. It's okay that we change, but it feels kind of strange that you're not in my life. Also, I'm watching my friend Lexi on YouTube while I do this. She has the same kind of content as I do. She does work weeks in my life and she has cats. So how cute. You should totally go watch her. I'll link her channel. Definitely put a little bit too much of the creamer. It's a little sweet, but it's really good. Matcha Sense did send me that matcha. They said if I like it, I can recommend it to you all, and I really did like it, so I'll reach out to them. I think we can get a coupon code, so I'll put it on the screen here. And I think you guys can get some amount of percentage off. I'll link it below. Just thought I'd share how <laughs> they're used. My mom cut his hair, but he wasn't being a good boy this time, so it's a little choppy, but that's all right. <laughs> I'll, I'll put a picture when he's super floofy up, because that's when he's the cutest. But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna get back to work now and talk to you guys later. I'll go get lunch with my family somewhere. So, take you along for that when the time comes. I have been honest with you from the start Don't say it's okay if I'm falling And you're running